All right, guys, we're back at the D1 store. Why? Because another drone has landed in Australia, and this is one of the most anticipated drones of 2023, the Inspire 3. Now, unfortunately, Aaron's on a shoot, so you're stuck with me, but let's check it out. I'm really excited about this one. What are you doing here? Great. Hey. All right, so we're in the D1 store in Brunswick. We've got Trent over here who's gonna take us through the Inspire 3. Yes, let's get into it. Let's go. We've got the clips at the front. Oh, let's open yeah. this up. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> so, first up, we've got the drone. Yep. We've got the RC Pro, grab that out, check it out. We've got the Zenmuse X9 8K Air Gimbal. Amazing. We got six batteries coming with it. We've got space for 10 batteries. We've got our charging hub up here as well. Let's grab the drone out and check it out. Yes, and let's right. remove this from <laughs> my face. <laughs> got the props out just for transport. We'll chuck the props back on. All right, so you've taken the props off. There is a chance they might get caught on the case. They could get caught, and yes. it's just so easy to put them on yep. this time anyway. Yep. We'll just do that just for just safety. Right. Fantastic. Let's bring it back <laughs> awesome. In the We've already got the batteries in it. Yep. So I guess it's the usual two taps to turn it on and then five taps to yeah. raise it. Yeah, that's it. Right. Let's turn it on. Nice. So we've got the 360 optical avoidance. We've got a fisheye on every corner. We've got cameras up and down. Time of flight sensors facing down as well. So we are very well protected, but it's still be a good pilot, mate, nothing's gonna go wrong with it. Absolutely. We've got the SSD right here. So it comes with this as well. Yep. Again, everything but the lens. The thing that I love about this is you don't have a Sydney station anymore. You Not anymore, like just a USB-C straight into the computer. Awesome. You can use it as an external hard drive as well, right? Exactly. Like just, yeah, it's yeah. just a normal little SSD. That's, That's awesome. awesome. Yep. And the yeah. FPV camera at the front, super low light. Same, Same specs dark. as the Avada. Yeah. Fantastic low light. Awesome. Pretty much night vision, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> yeah. it's pretty close. Yeah. This is hey. something that I'm really interested yeah. in. This it's angle slow. of attack yeah. here yeah. is so high. And I guess, especially if you're flying and you switch to landing gear down instead yep. of you know the the up that it's known for you'll get some extra vertical mm. angle so attack. we got 28 minute flight time uh while it's in landing gear down we got a huge angle of attack to bring the gimbal yeah. and camera sensor up and while it's in normal mode drops down a couple minutes of flight time and up. talking about that flight time it is hot swappable yes. so you can easily land it swap it out get back in the air pretty quickly yeah awesome. i mean it's fantastic you said it comes with three sets six batteries that looks like the charging station. Yes, yeah, so that's gonna charge 10 of them. We've got three modes, fast charging, standard charging. Does it charge all at the same time? No, so we're gonna be okay. charging in pairs and in fast charging mode, it's gonna choose the highest ones, bring them up to 90, do it across the board and then trickle charge the rest. That's now, awesome. do you need to use the same sets of batteries? You should absolutely should, absolutely yeah. should. So just so you can track the health of the batteries, you can see how many cycles they do, it's gonna come with some stickers, just mm -hmm. put them on, yep. pair them up. And it is missing something, one of the flagship <laughs> reasons that you want to get the Inspire 3, which is the X9 Air, 8K, 8K Air. Let's put yeah, it on. 8K. X9, 8K, 8K Air. <laughs> and in that 8K, I believe that's 75 Ooh. frames you can get. Absolutely, yep. and we've got 14 stops of dynamic range. It is beautiful. Yeah. Like. Grab it with it, but we got also Apple ProRes, mm, same yes. as the Inspire 2. Let's pop Put it on. on. So lenses, it's a separate purchase. Yes. So four lenses, right? 18 mil? 18, 35, 24, and 50. Mm. Yep, yep, amazing. Do you want to check out the controller? You, yes. Now the RC Plus, now this seems to be sort of like the- Same as the M30. There's mm. nothing different, same model. Technically the same, all the yep. buttons are the same. Everything's customizable on it. Yep. Uh, it's just. Different firmware, different pilot app yep. with all the cinema features. Does it come with this? It does. Okay. Awesome. So oh, it's so kit. We also got the chest strap in there as well. Ooh. So you can like really just That's such a great idea. keep it close to yeah. yourself, be accurate. I mean, the controller, we, we do, you know, a whole bunch of inspection stuff with the M30 mm. and it's, it's a light controller anyway, but yeah. this just is, you just sometimes just, you need your hands free, right? For your Change M30, lenses. you could like pull this off yeah. or grab it separately yeah. too. 60 frames? Yes. So refresh. So it's coming, yeah. so we're streaming 4K into the controller. Yep. Mm. We're saving the 8K to the Wait. drone. So you're actually yeah. getting 4K straight into vision. it. Yeah. That's huge. That's like the case of like the Mavic, like yeah. while you're flying. Amazing. Saving 4K to it. Amazing. Brilliant. It's also streaming 4K. So like they got the whole cinema ecosystem. Yeah. Let's say you've got the three axis master wheels. You can set that up with the high right monitor. Mm. You've got the high right monitor combo with the handles as well. 
and that's all 4K, and that's gonna be another operator doing your gimbal controls while you're in flight. Mm. Now, some of the features of this that I think really, I'm gonna say it, Aaron. Don't no, I'm not gonna say it. Don't say it, don't say it. <laughs> <laughs> you weren't supposed to actually hit me. <laughs> so anyway, one of the things that I'm really excited about is the 3D dolly. This yes. has RTK integration. It does. Now, most people would think RTK, oh, we can use this as an inspection drone or industrial mm. drone, but that's not what this is built for. No, it's, it's not gonna be saving like RTK survey metadata to your photos. That's pretty separate with DJI stuff. What we are getting is the repeatable missions, like super, super accurate, just bang on accurate missions. And then every time you come back and fly that again, new gimbal position, yeah. new camera controls, new when framing. You, when you say accurate, you're talking about three centimeters, right? I'm talking about three, four centimeters, okay. yeah. So getting through little, yeah. little doors, palm trees, whatever. Yeah, so we can build waypoint missions yeah. on it or we can record a flight to do it again. We have seen some pretty impressive mm. examples of that previously. Now. To do that, you will need the RTK2 base station. Yeah. Is that right? Correct. Yep. So that, that is sold separately, it doesn't come with it. It's gonna be a local tripod station set up just for you. Yeah, okay, fantastic. So just back to the, that 3D dolly as well. I mean, we've seen examples of that. Essentially, you can set that up in 3D space. It's like a dolly in the air. So it's as simple as moving your, once it's set up, yep. moving the, the drone left and right, yep. and it will fly that flight path super accurately. Yeah, the mission set, you're just choosing the acceleration yeah. after the fact, and someone else or yourself is choosing the gimbal controls. Yeah. And I guess if you don't have uh, a second controller or friends, hmm. then you can quite easily control this as a single operator Definitely. much easier. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Similar to like the Mavic 3, you saw they got the waypoint modes. We can do, mm. um, let's say, cruise control mode as well, that same here. Any other software features that's just unique to the Inspire 3? Unique to this yeah. in comparison, like the two or the one definitely, we've yeah. got the time code sync port at the bottom. Ooh, that's gonna be good. Super important Talk to you about that real quick. Yep. What does yeah. that mean? So what if you mean? could sync up your other cameras, sync up your audio, they're all running from the same time code. We can put a dongle down here and just sync it in immediately. Awesome. So yep. post-production, you're in your editor, everything lines up. Talk to us about Spotlight Pro. <laughs> Spotlight Pro. So similar to the 30, you would, would be used to that. Like cars, people, they're all just like pointed out. You're gonna grab them and just track around them. All your controls are gonna be relative to what you're looking at. It's never gonna lose tracking in most situations, yeah. but it's gonna be fantastic. Yeah. Awesome. Well, we, I we think we'll have an opportunity to, mm. to, <laughs> to try that out. Chase some cars, eh? So I guess the last thing that I know that uh, our audience wants mm. to know is price. Price, yeah. it's looking around the $20,000 mark. And that comes with everything but lenses? That comes with everything we've seen except lenses. Okay, okay. sure. So batteries, remote, drone itself, six batteries, gimbals. Six, pairs. yeah, six batteries. Mm. Uh, cost mm. of a full set of lenses? A full set of lenses, we're looking Give or take about five or six thousand. Okay. Yep. Yeah. yeah. So that's some serious equipment then. Well, if yeah. you're serious about buying this, you'd get the whole mm. you'd get the whole kit, right? and, yeah. But there sure. is a link in the description for five percent off mm. if you use UA Visuals five, I believe that's okay. Five percent's very good, especially on a new drone. If you need to like customize or talk through any of the features, you can also reach out to enterprise at d1store.com.au. All right. Fantastic. All right, well <laughs> look. I think it's time for us to pack this down and go for a fly. Let's go chase some cars. <laughs> All right, let's do it.